And welcome back guys, we're going to be playing some more Starfield. Make sure to hit the like button, make sure to subscribe button, let's get into it.
things for you. I admit, calling for help isn't usually how I work. But you'd be surprised how eager the other Starborn were to join in. Imagine to tell you the number of incidents. Unlike the others you've found that are separated from each other. You'll feel it as we get further. The power of the artifact seeps through the seams of reality here. The Starborn here are powerful. They will hold nothing back. Even the dead can be made to fight for them. And many of my kind aren't above making use of machines. They had this military base built for a reason.
Set aside anything useful and just leave the rest. When you have a few moments, there's something I'd like to discuss. Some enterprising starborn lord human mercenaries here. They built this facility. Another layer to get past before we can reach the temple. Expect more starborn along the way.
see that anomaly? The temple's artifact is reacting to all the fighting. It might be the only way through. Okay, you. You're up. If something goes wrong in there, we'll come get you. Why would anything go wrong? Shouldn't we... Would you shut up? Both of you do your job. You all right? That was a shift in space-time, a, a dip into the multiverse. We'll have to go through a few more to reach the center. like yours, I suspect. A beginning. A regret. All right.
got something for me? Wager that the reactor in there was this facility's primary power source. We have visitors. Welcome! What's mine is yours! Well, no, it's still mine, but you get what I mean. I'm impressed! How did you... Did you... You don't deserve the final artifact. This life you've led, you're nothing but a thief! An opportunist! A liar. It's more than credits that the Unity will demand of you. You think you have a right to the infinite? You're nothing! Guards! <laughs> On me! Uh, Let's go! Okay, go ahead! Move! 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 Hurry! Come on, Rook. Come on. You can make it. Barely stepped on the juryman's road with us. Can't see another soul off to the void so soon. No. No! I'll pour one out to the blackest sea for you, Rook. Ghost. What kind of cruelty is this? This some starborn trick? Come to mock me before you twist the blade? Multiple universes? You're a visitor jumping through the gates of space and time? Not sure if you're just a reflection of a shattered brain, but okay, I get your meaning. Well, ghost from the other side, I'll keep what you said rolling around in my head for a spell. But for now, 
Wouldn't mind if you gave me a bit. I just lost a friend. Already, I don't like how generous the game is right now. Look at all the ammo it's giving me. I'm like, uh, okay, is this end game? I don't know if it's end game. All I know is it's being way too generous. This usually means boss fight. This is what it usually means when you get all this random stuff.
I guess I shouldn't be too surprised you made it this far. It serves me right for not being convincing enough. you have all the artifacts, we should talk. Let's go. 
You made it. I hope you're enjoying the view. I never get tired of staring at it. Eternity. A thought occurs. Can anyone ever truly experience reality outside oneself? All of time and space filters through a singular perspective. I am as much you as you are part of everything. All points connect to here. When a star is born or dies, its existence beats through the heart of this place. The unity. I have seen all you are, have been, and could be. Do you feel like you've lived a good life? Is there anything you regret? That's good. You'll need that clarity for what comes next. In order to become Starborn, you must give the universe one last thing. Yourself. That intangible part of you, that something that makes you unique amongst the infinite, will explode like a supernova. A part of you will fuse with the essence of this universe, while another part leaves it behind forever. Do you understand what I mean? This one final leap will change this universe forever, even as you leave it behind. Unknowingly, you just answered your own questions. For who creates things but creators? That is what they have been named throughout the endless circle of time. Are they one or many? Human or alien? Terrestrial or celestial? One day, you might even meet the creators. But not this day. As for the why, so that you could ask that very question. So that you could stand before me for time immemorial and delve into the mysteries of the unending cosmos. Much like the death of a star creating new kinds of matter, so will part of your being become fused with the unity itself. That part is what becomes starborn and crosses into the multiverse. Through your eyes, it will be as if waking up from a dream. Walk into the gate of light, and you will become starborn. Everything will vanish, and you will awaken somewhere else. But, that isn't your only potential destiny. You could turn around, walk away from the unity until the stars fade away, and you will wake up on your ship in your universe. You could live out the life you have. I've enjoyed speaking to you once again. All of you. Every version that is here in the Unity right now. Go out into the stars. As you consider stepping towards infinity, I offer you a glimpse into what will happen to the universe you may be leaving, as the essence of who you are is spread throughout space and time. Although you leave this universe behind, a new universe awaits you. Who will you be in this one? What choices will you make?
Wow, I was wondering if the game would ever end. <laughs> yeah, it's how long we've been on this series. I'm just here. Okay. Is this ever going to end some point? <laughs> Anyways, let's go ahead and see where we're at now. I'm guessing we're at end game. Where we finished the game, but there's a couple things we can do afterwards. I remember hearing the reviews of people not being very happy that they zipped through the storyline and they couldn't do certain things, so let's go find out. you this unprovoked attack on a Excuse me, this is a private... Wait. 
There's something familiar about you. Vasco, identify. Scanning. Cross-referencing known employee records of our affiliated organizations. Please remain still. This appears to be the miner from Argos Extractors. Lost as we were carrying the artifact from Vectera. Current whereabouts previously unknown. I see. Vasco already delivered the artifact. So, why are you showing up now? Hmm. Interesting. You want this rock breaker in our organization? After getting lost the first time? But she still showed up, didn't she? Isn't persistence a signature trait for an explorer? We're at the beginning of a very important discovery here. What you found on Vectera, the artifact. There's more. And they're creating something we don't understand yet. If you're serious about wanting to be a part of this, then you have to know that we are diving headfirst into the unknown. There could be considerable risks. Good. We'll set you up with a room. Take some time to meet everyone. Then, when you're ready, you and I will be doing some traveling together. Get your feet wet. Sarah is the best possible person to be running on this election at a time like this. Focus. So, Nonsense. are you ready to get to We're going to be doing some old-fashioned detective work. The artifacts are relatively inert once they're out of bedrock. That means people can pass... I've been letting my contacts know to be on the lookout for strange... We have to assume that we're not the only ones, but most people are an odd-looking rock or... Felt the same way when I... But it's not just that. I'm going to be sticking with you for this. We'll need to head to Mast. Check in with the Vanguard recruiting office where my contact works. And listen, whatever you were before, or whatever you do once you're out there, I don't care. So long as you don't bring UC security to our doors. Every member of Constell... Good. Let's take a little stroll through New... Space explorer. You hey, you ever think of joining up with a vanguard? Help the United Colonies, earn some credits, even get your UC citizenship? All right, all right. Can't blame me for trying, right? I mean, I still haven't given up on getting Sarah to reenlist. It's a game we play. He asks. Here's what I got for you two. The Soul System. Which admiral did he upset to get that posting? He's Martian, born and raised. Word is he's got some fancy metal ornament he's been showing off to the old ground. Soul system is a... You mean hitting the bars? Hey, nothing wrong with a little... Re 
anything for Sarah. No, oh, brother. I'm serious about that recruitment offer, by the way. So I'm guessing what's happening right now is we're basically replaying the game. I'm guessing that's what happened because my base that's usually here is no longer there. Do you see the output marker saying it's there? I don't see one. So what it's looking like is... So what it looks like is we beat the game, you are reborn as Starborn, and you have the choice to replay the entire game, but but you have a Starborn ship? That's what it seems like here. Now I understand why people are getting upset where you know everything, their base is gone, their ship's gone, and you're stuck with a Starborn ship, and you have nothing but a Starborn ship. Are you kidding me? So I'm going to guess that's going to be the end of that series, because from what I'm seeing here, it's having you replay the game, and it's just the same shit again. I mean, I don't mind playing the game again, just to see a different ending, but I was expecting, you know, it, compared to, like, Fallout 3 it was, where you get a DLC and you can continue your gameplay and you can still access all your gear. I was expecting something like that, not... I was not expecting to get to the end of the game and... Oh cool, you're given a Starborn ship, some uh, a space shoot for a star um, Starborn, that's it. I was not expecting to have them make me replay the game. Or the option to replay it, and I'm like, eh, yeah. Originally, I was going to replay this, but after seeing how many series parts there are, I'm like, yeah, maybe not. Maybe when I get really bored, I'll replay it, but uh, it's not going to be anytime soon because I've got like three other series going right now, so i got to start killing some of those series off before I'm willing to replay Starfield here. Which, you know, when the DLC comes out for Starfield, I'll be playing Starfield, but you see my point here? I was expecting, I don't know, something a little less nerfy. I was not expecting the ending to nerf um, the ending here. I'm actually going to try something here. I'm going to try going back to my last save and see what happens. the biscuit and delete that one. There's the lodge. We're gonna reload the lodge. I'm gonna see if I can choose the other option where I can skip the main storyline and see what happens. There's the lodge. Excuse me, this is a... Wait. Vasco, identify. Scanning. This appears to be the... I see. Vasco already... D You're a... I see. So some of our theories about the artifacts are correct. You're taking their word for it? What if this person's just delusional? Breathe in too many gases in that mining operation. Why don't we hear her out? We know next to nothing. We have everything to gain if she's telling the truth. All right, let's hear it.
So, that's what we're looking for. The pieces to an armillary. A path to the center of a multiverse. This is either the truth or the most elaborate practical joke I've ever witnessed. I think we're past the point of doubting, Walter. In any event, we'll be able to see for ourselves. We know where most of the artifacts are now, and presumably how we get them. And if what you've told us about the Starborn is to be believed, we'll need all the help we can get. I want you to check with Vladimir on the eye. Cross-reference what you've told us with what he's picking up on the scans. You track down the artifacts the eye finds, while we gather the others. And we are grateful for that, Starborn. Now, let's get those artifacts. Tried skipping the main quest, and this is what it crapped out. <laughs> uh, what do I got for health? Okay, I have one health there, kiddo. Okay, that's so helpful. Not really. I prefer my weapons back. <laughs> Makes it so much easier. What level am I? 95? Oh yeah, yeah. Those little pieces are gonna do something. <laughs> All it is customary to say, welcome. Alright, where am I going? Isn't the woman I'm supposed to know from another side? That was some meeting to listen in on. Starborn, are you? Anyone who doesn't charge into a room swinging is a friend in my book. Tried crossing all the T's with the information you unloaded to Sarah and the others. I've got good news in bed. Good news is the eyes found what you're looking for. Bad news is they're not in the places you said they'd be. Here's the data. Managed to find a planet that might have one of those temples you talked about as well. Can probably find more temples if I have enough time to cross-reference. Come back when you've given the first one the thorough comb. Thank <laughs> you. 
I'm guessing it's going to make me get all the artifacts. I'm going to guess something different comp happens at the end. Or it's probably the same thing. We'll have to find out, aren't we? Alrighty, that looks like a good place to stop. I noticed that it is a, one of those facilities you have to go inside of, and I might end up getting lost in there, so probably a good place to stop the video here, and I'll start another one. Um, make sure to hit the like button, make sure to subscribe button. We'll go find all these artifacts again, we'll see what happens, but I'm going to consider this video here is where the game ended, because it did come up with a credit line, so that technically counts as the game was, you know, we've completed the game, but now there's some after stuff that we gotta do, so I don't know. It's kinda weird. Anyways, make sure you hit the like button, make sure you subscribe button. I'll see you guys again soon.